Greetings Multiverse and we're back with episode 10 of Titans Season 2. We're getting very, very close to the end right now. The Titans are basically completely split up. Dick's got himself arrested. <laughs> and there are too many storylines going on to keep track of. So much so I've forgotten most of them. In fact, half of them seem to have been arrested. But I'm going to get on with episode 10 of Titans right now. I'm not to get through. Let's just go. Go. Okay, which storyline are we going to pick up from first? Dick Grayson, of course. You idiot, Grayson. <sighs> okay, we're in a 70s cop show now. In the next storyline... <laughs> right. Who are these people? Please have a massive car crush immediately. I can't believe Garfield ran off. <sighs> It doesn't exactly endear me to the, any of them. <laughs> I said get the hell out of here, you stupid mutt! Go! He still completely understood every single word he said. I'm sorry. I'm out of the business of helping people. Grayson, you're getting on my nerves now. Detective. Grayson! What is wrong with you? <laughs> also, what's wrong with that guard? Your fault, Gar. It's all your fault, Gar. Call me back. Why doesn't he phone someone other than Dick Grayson? Why doesn't he phone Bruce Wayne? What? There. <laughs> the smartest one of the lot. <laughs> so Rachel, what are you doing? <laughs> what, is, what is any of them doing, really? <laughs> it's almost slightly annoying. And I love this show. <laughs> would, would anyone object if I forwarded through this episode and skipped to the next one? And get back to the the interesting plot lines, you know, Deathstroke, Blackfire. You can ring a doorbell with his nose. I've seen them. Thank you, God. At least he came back. Stay away from me. I killed the guy once. I clawed him to pieces. I'm I'm glad they remember the fact that Gar's killed someone. <laughs> and so's Crypto probably. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Finally! Huh. Well, they're, well, they're never gonna find him. She's been sat there eating for a long time. <laughs> In the next plot line. <laughs> Maybe they're working for Deathstroke. Mm. Or Blackfire. Has she got control of it? I think she might have. Gonna hurt from that fall though, yeah. Ooh, ow. Oh. You're fucking awesome. Yay! Someone probably said it. <laughs> Aww. Whoa! Okay, she's possessing gargoyles. That's pretty cool. <laughs> oh. Okay, is he actually going to do that? What's that? Obviously not. The there we go. <laughs> Never that easy, calling Batman. <laughs> Whoa! Ah! Funny, also point scene. I think they have been prepared for this. I'm pitching a kryptonite bullet. No, no kryptonite. <laughs> yeah. No, you shouldn't have said that out loud to the person with really good hearing. <laughs> Let me guess. They're gonna kick now, them. Graves, there we go. <laughs> you? Is she here? No, she sent me instead. It's okay. It's just tranquilizers to calm him. 
I'm here to help you. It's not what it feels like. Yeah, it really doesn't. Do you want to hurt me? I'm not sure. Do you want to hurt those police officers? I don't know. I don't think so. These are not easy questions, Connor. Let us help you. After all, we created you. We can fix you. Fix? And what's happening to you? It's our fault. Mm. A balance we didn't consider, but now that we understand it, we can stop it. Tempting him with something he wants. All you have to do is come home. Ooh. Ouch. Tempting. Of course he's going to do it, isn't he? Alasul. <laughs> Nightwing. You know Alasul? <laughs> Gone. Is that a cold village Al -Asul's our hero. He <laughs> lives between the moon and the stars. Hmm. And in the time of greatest need, he flies down and saves you. A bird that comes in the night and saves people. <laughs> yeah, tonight, he's going to save us. <laughs> the Nightwing. <We'll> see. <laughs> he says one good thing come out of this storyline. <laughs> I thought he wouldn't ask Holden ever did. Wait, did she just say colder? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, okay. <laughs> so her gargoyle was off hunting people. Dick, I need you to call me back. I don't have anyone else in my phone book. That was the worst escape in history. <laughs> Whoa! How did he get there? Honestly, actually, how did he get there? <laughs> Whoa! That's pretty cool. So, now what are you doing, Grayson? What do we do about him? He's going to be a titan. Reunited with his team. I think it's an excellent idea. Hmm. Hmm. What? <laughs> See, this is a bit more interesting. I like this storyline. <laughs> okay, that was episode 10 of season 2 of Titans. And I'm not sure I'm liking where this is going. Notice how Deathstroke, Starfire and Hank and Dawn were in this, which was sort of a relief in the case of Hank and Dawn. A, bit, a slight relief with Starfire. But at the same time, is this all just to get that? Just to turn Dick into Nightwing. It seems rather elaborate. There's self-loathing. There's punishment. There is atonement. And then there is getting yourself thrown into a correctional facility. And nearly getting yourself killed. And not telling any of your team. It's somehow even worse. Then there's what I was going with Raven. Which is probably the more interesting one. Then Connor. Gar. And now Mercy Graves as well. All sort of all together on a crash course. There are too many storylines going on. And most of them weren't even in this episode. <laughs> but okay, it's still fun, but I think they've kind of gone off course a little bit. The Deathstroke storyline was fun. The Starfire storyline was sort of fun. The Connor storyline is good, and I like that. I like the way it's going. But they need to pick and choose. There are too many storylines. I said that the last episode, and it's sort of got even worse now. I am not interested with what's going on with Dick Grayson right now. And I never thought I'd ever say those words. It's gone far too far for tangent. I like this. I like the idea this is where he gets the Nightwing idea. But it's a little bit too far. A little bit too far away from the actual plot of the season. If this were a 24 episode season, maybe. But it's only like, what, 12, 13 episodes? 13, I think. So we've just got three more to go and we have to wrap up about like two dozen storylines. Okay, fine, whatever. <laughs> I'm still enjoying it, but I'm not sure about this episode. <laughs> it needs a real storyline prune. But what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to DC Comics Gamer for everything on the worlds of DC. And if you really, really want to spot me out, I have a Patreon. If you can kick me a single dollar a month, I will be able to do a lot more with this channel, I'll be able to do more reaction videos, I'll be able to do more videos in general, 
and I'm going to start doing exclusive videos very soon. Anything that's not a reaction video or something really time dependent, I'm going to start putting up on the Patreon exclusively. So if you want access to that early, Patreon, right there. Single dollar a month, you can get that. Thanks for watching, folks. For now, Multiverse, out.